Well, it has been just over a year since a teenager died after a hit and run drunk driving crash after a concert at Darien Lake. And today that teen's mother spoke in remembrance of her son before a judge delivered the punishment for the driver who killed him. And two on your side's Jeff Preval has this story and that mother's message. Jeff? And Adam and Mary Alice, the mother of the victim in this tragedy, says that her son was having the summer of his life and was quickly growing up to become a doctor. She also says that the penalty that the defendant got, although the maximum, is not long enough. Donna Linsky told the judge that losing her 18-year-old son, Connor, shattered her and her family's lives. Connor, while leaving a concert last summer at Darien Lake, was walking on the shoulder of a road when he was hit by 48-year-old Jennifer Serrano. She and a friend who was also in the car had been drinking and did not stop. Connor's mother not only spoke about the her that they feel every day, but also the happiness that Connor brought to their lives. Connor was full of joy. When you were around him, you couldn't help but feel his happiness and his love for life. He wasn't loud and boisterous. He was a listener, a thinker. He had his grandfather's steel blue eyes and his father's wonderful sense of humor. Now, right after the crash, Serrano continued to drive drunk and nearly ran into a sheriff's deputy. She was charged with DWI, had her license suspended, and was released on bail because police did not know that she hit Connor Linsky and was involved in that hit and run. Serrano's defense attorney says that Serrano is sorry for what she did. Now, Serrano did get the max allowed by law four and two thirds to 14 years for vehicular manslaughter in the second degree and leaving the scene of the accident to honor Connor Linsky. His family has created a scholarship in his name, which will be offered to graduating high school seniors and future medical students. I'm Jeff Perval, Channel 2 News.